Do you ever feel like your parents messed you up? Like you have these behaviors that you inherited? So this is my teacup collection. I have about 150 different teacups. You're not alone. The reason why is because as we grow up as a child, our brain is in developmental mode. So even though parents will say, do as I say and not as I do, we are so young and impressionable at that age that we're basically taking in all of the responses, all of the reactions that our parents have because we're around them the most. And that's what we think being a human is all about. So we may have adopted some behaviors that we really don't like or that aren't as healthy as they could be without really knowing it. Here are some common examples of things that you may have picked up from your caretakers growing up without realizing it. For example, if you had a parent that was afraid of confrontation and never really learned how to communicate well, you may have picked up some of those traits and find yourself biting your tongue but not finding a way of how to communicate or set boundaries. We're all human and we all tend to either underuse or overuse certain emotions. Let's say you had a parent that overused anger. Maybe they felt fear, maybe they felt insecurity, but they didn't know how to express that and it just came out as being angry all the time. And now we start the Dysfunctional Family Roles interview. Perfect. Let's go ahead and make them the head of the household. As a child, when you see that and it instills the fear inside of you, you may decide, I am never going to be like that. And in turn, you end up suppressing your anger and finding it really hard to get that emotion out and process it. Or you may have picked up the behavior and then end up doing the same thing to your children. Once you kind of open your eyes to what you may have picked up or how your parents or caretakers behaviors affected you, you may feel resentment, anger, a whole range of emotions. And that is perfectly healthy. Don't let anybody tell you that you shouldn't feel a certain way. So any behavior is simply a behavior. It doesn't mean that's who you are as a person. It doesn't make you a bad person. Think about it. You're learning these things as a child throughout most of your life. You've reacted a certain way. What is in your control is how you decide to heal yourself. I believe in you. Thank you for watching Stop Look and Listen with Samantha.